All right, guys, Illy here. I've been trying for the last half an hour, maybe more, to actually get a game in. <laughs> so I apologize if I've only got one game to upload because I tr I've been trying real hard. But the first two that I played, my sound was all buggy, so I couldn't actually get... Uh, I, I had zero game audio and zero me audio. Uh, me audio being the most important. And then I played three other games where the guy just surrendered right out of the gate. So I don't really know what's up, but we're going to we're gonna give it one more go here. I got at least one more try before I've got to get ready for my final this evening. Um, but either way, I'm playing a buff Freya, which uh, has already been pretty proven. Um, it already works. We know that. The, uh, the question is, to what degree does it work? Gift of Munin does stack, but my leader will likely die, so I'm not going to play it. Instead, I'm going to play the Scotty. One, two, three. Okay, so he can always get to the Scotty there, so I'm going to play it back here. This is the stone I, I, I look to be pushing on early, so that's, uh, that's the stone I'm going to try to go for. If I can deal five damage to the stone, that's going to be fine, because then I can always uh, charge my leader from hand with Enrage, and then kill the stone, because that's 5 damage. So if I can get it down to 5 HP, uh, I'm going to try to go to the other uh, other stone. And this is a map, 1, 2, 3, 4, where I can't get it from spawn, per se. So I'll have to think about that as well. So charging from hand won't work on this particular map. Which probably makes this deck a lot worse. So did he just, I wasn't even paying attention. He used Valhalla Sorcery and Ansus. Okay. So I've got four mana. Sign of Doom wants to be used. I mean, regardless, this is happening. So now the real question is, do I... Calder Soul, or do I Scion Calder? I'm going to choose to put the stone. At 4 HP. Which is relevant because that's turn that can turn into a 2 2 and then um, that will do 2 damage as well. And 3 damage plus 1 damage as well. So th there's a there's a variety of combinations there. As well as the soul coming out for 1 damage onto the stone, and then the leader auto for 3. Um, but my, my opponent here has gone for a super slow hand. Like, he's got a lot of cards, but that card advantage doesn't mean too much right now. So he's going to have to speed things up a bit if he wants to win. Right, so... What's the most efficient way to kill this stone? It's 3 plus 1. So Soul is coming out. And hitting that stone there. Now Scotty... We'll hit the leader. Doge bites the stone. And then... You hitting the leader is actually not too relevant versus the stone. I'm going to hit the leader, though, just to remove it off the field. Like, if he were to pop... Um, and to get me more card draw, too. If he were to pop... Well, I would have got it either way. Um, if he were to pop a Gunyers there, it could have actually been pretty dangerous for me. But either way... That's a win. That's a Freya rush deck for you. 